Hey everybody, this is Arathus and welcome back to Foundation. So there isn't a whole lot left to do in the game, but we have a few things I want to play around with. One, let's see if we can't expand our keep, our Lord's Manor a bit. Also, our Splendor when it comes to the Kingdom is absolute crap, that's why we can't unlock any of this. So, I think what we're going to do next is we're going to work on building the keep. Now, I feel like logically we should build the keep around our current um, fortress, our current manor. It seems like those two would be linked. I also kind of want to buy this plot of land over here, or hey, even this plot of land, to build the monastery. I feel like the monastery would be a good fit on the island. So we're going to buy that land for the monastery. And yeah, we're going to start up on some big projects here. So let's go ahead and unpause the game and get to it. Uh, what? You want fish. Enjoy the fish. I mean, my, apparently my people aren't eating the fish very quickly. All right, so our also our bakery and mills are finally staffed. So it looks like the bread is slowly getting better, as is the clothing situation. Hopefully we can keep it at that level. But I still don't have all of my market stalls and... What are these? The gathering huts. Uh, fully staffed. So that'll be the next goal with all the people coming in. All right, let's go ahead and work on the Lord Manor some more. I mean, I'm, I'm sure it's not really super necessary. There aren't a lot of buildings for the Lord's Manor. Like, I mean, we have the stone main building, a uh, stone extension, chimney, doors. Yeah, we got the tax office. See, there's not a lot really to put here. So we might not build any more of this. And also, we still have a lot of wooden parts. So I think we're just going to... I kind of want to get the Splendor at least to 100, because, I mean, our clergy splendor is really high. So, what gives us more splendor? Not a whole lot, except for, like, the core and the towers. Why is it the small treasury adds influence, but the large one doesn't? I'm confused. Oh, well, I guess we're going to be building small treasuries. I can attach them to this little building here. Yeah, this is a core that I didn't build earlier. Like, I actually realized we didn't even have a core building in our manor, so... So this will give us a nice boost. I actually like the look of that. Okay, game. What I would like to do is I'd like to build another manor, well, another core over here. And there is a bit of a problem with that. Let's make it a little taller. Let's do the small treasuries once again on either side. feel like that's not quite tall enough. Ah, well. And let's put a door. If we can. It's apparently going to be going straight towards the well, so okay. <laughs> Alright, now, do the extensions really do anything? Not really. Hmm. Let's go ahead and start construction on this and see what happens. Now, I'm going to move over here. And we are going to start building... Well, first of all, let's see if we have anybody we can put to work. Because right now I think what I need are the market tenders put into place. Uh, just so they can actually sell the food and the clothing that we're finally making some headway on. Alright. 
Not a wooden keep. We already have a wooden keep. Uh, not a good one. We're going to have to build a better one, but still. Ooh. That is a lot of options. Purple. Yeah, I'm not going to lie. I'm not a fan of purple, but... Okay, so we have this kind of abbey. Or we have a really ornate abbey. I feel like that should be the core. Is the really ornate one. Put that up here. Okay, that is way too bloody tall. But let's make it impressive. Regardless. Okay. Gonna need some doors. What's door A look like? Door B. Ah. There we go. I can at least see the doors now. Door C. Oh, I like door C. I'll put it right here. Now. <clears throat> Cloister, well, we have we have to put a dorm in. And I feel like the dorm would be... Wow, okay, there's a pivot point right there. Huh. Well, I don't want to pivot it, so we're going to put it there. I don't want dorms on either side. Does it look identical on each side? It does. Nope, wrong spot. Middle spot. Thank you. Okay. Want towers. I mean, of course we want towers. This is a monastery after all. Okay, let's do another tower. Okay, what direction... Catch that right. Doesn't seem right. But there is only one point right there it can attach to. Alright, let's make you a bit taller. Now, <clears throat> we can put the crosses up. Because we're going to need to. I kind of just want to build a monastery. Decorative bushes. Why are there two apiaries that look identical? Ah, two new villager villagers. Good God. I feel like this needs to be a tick higher to be on par with its buddy over here. Okay, cloister center. Cloister corner. Ooh. Cloister center B. Okay, I like that. We'll mess around with that shortly. Ex Extensions, though. Hmm, yeah. Oh, what's the other extensions? Ooh, I actually like that one. Wow, they got a lot of fun stuff with this. Alright, let's throw in one of these. No, not like that. Attached to, the, attached to the tower. And then... Looks, yeah, this extension. It looks like a gate to me. And then we're going to do another extension A. Another extension A. Extension C. Extension A. Oh, I like the look of this. Alright, I want another pair of towers. Mm-hmm. 
Nope, nope, no, no. Can we attach this again? Hey. Hey, you bastard. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, that that's a little annoying. But hey. Nah, I think I'm gonna leave that at the default height. Okay, let's try switching that around. It actually looks a lot better like that. An envoy. I don't care about the envoy. The envoy does nothing but demands crap from me. <sighs> I'll help the people this time. I should have probably always helped the people. Hmm. Okay. Now, give me my towers back. Do not snap over there and control the other one. I don't want it. Do another cross. Uh, just because I don't have any other uh, things to put on top. This is going to be a massive undertaking. Then again, monasteries typically were. So, at least in that case, it is very accurate. Now, maybe we should start doing a cloister in the center. Let's do... Ooh. That looks horrible. Does it connect better to the cloister? It really does not. Why? Why? Okay. Hmm. Okay, then. I guess we'll try that. It's actually coming a along nicely, I think. Oh my god. And cloister corner. Corner. Not like that. There we go. Now, let's move the whole... The whole... Oh my... Okay. You know what? Game. <laughs> Stop. They're not like a gate where I can... I guess not. Well, you know what? We'll leave it like this. Because we're going to make a... Oh, God. Maybe do this a little bit in. There we go. I can live with that. Now... We're going to go with some more extensions. I think this time we're going to go with, like, extension. Ooh. That'll work. No, it won't. Extension C. Extension B this time. And no. I guess extension A is the one that's more proper for this. How are our people? Are they still happy? 
they appear to be Okay, I'm gonna take this over here. Gonna go with another pair of towers. Yeah, I think this will work. And I know we got some new people, so I'm gonna go assign them to jobs shortly. Okay, no, 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 you. Crosses. I mean, I guess I can just cut off the cloister because it's supposed to be. I mean, honestly, that's how they work. Good God, look at all this and the maintenance cost. Jesus. Oh, glass. Yeah, no, this isn't going to be done for a long time. That's fine. Wait, what? That is a massive structure for an herb garden. Wow. Does it connect to anything? I mean, it could connect there, but I, mean, I don't think it needs to connect. Hmm. Maybe that's what's intended. You know, it's supposed to connect to the exterior of the place a little bit. I'm going to just put it right here. Sure, that works. Put a door. Let's put a few more doors, though, because there's not much in the way of, you know, ways to get into this place. Okay. Door B apparently does not want to connect it. Okay. Sure. All right, let's put in the apiaries now as well, though. I feel like that would probably go best, like, right here. Now, is there anything else that this requires? I guess we put some fireplaces and stuff in. No, apparently not. Oh, okay, now it'll connect. Sure, there you guys go. Enjoy. That is gonna take forever. But that's fine. Oh, we ain't got nowhere near that much iron. But, hey, give it a shot. Alright, so we did manage to get our Splendor over 100 over here. Good. Close this, let them just work at, as they will. We got a bunch of people while I was busy over there. Oh good, food is starting to stabilize. Wow, did that many people show up while I was messing around with that? Jesus. All right, well. You know, I'll go ahead and assign another soldier to the manor. And I'll need soldiers for the treasuries. But that's fine. Alright, now. While that's going, let's work on the keep. Feels like the keep should be located. You know. Like I said, over here with the rest of our dudes. Question is, do we want to do their gate? Because we should. 
Nope, apparently not. Okay. Two new villagers, thank you. Now, let's try to just make the keep. Open the gate. I'm gonna try to put it right here. Their job is, a, is as far as I'm concerned, wait, what? I can't make it any bigger. Oh. Okay. Well, also, you guys up here were cutting these trees down. Could build a keep there. Hmm. Nice progress is being made over there. I wonder if I should build the keep over here. Eh, we'll see. Let's go ahead and just build something over here. The core. Like down here at like the southern tip of our island. Dude. I'll help my people. You don't need my help. You just want to keep taking my troops. Can I, can I make this a bit taller? Thank you. I like that roof. Okay. Yeah, I'll put that there. Yeah, maybe away from... Okay, there is nowhere else to put it. Okay, we're going to put the gate, the door here, I guess. Seriously, that's as far as you'll let me take it. All right. kind of wish there was an extension system, but there's not for the keep, it looks like. Which is really odd to me. And this won't connect. Weird. Yeah, the keep is a little odd to deal with. I'm not going to lie. Hmm. Yeah, it's really just a bunch of little towers. That's disappointing. I was hoping there was more, more, but there's not. I'm sure it's coming though. As we know, game's work in progress. I don't even know why there's an option for a wooden gate considering I can't really do anything else with this area. I'll put in a few training dummies around the ground. Okay, I don't know why it does that when I rotate the screen. Do two training dummies per keep. Yeah, like I said, I wish there was more variety as to what I could do with this. But so far, not a whole lot I can do. I mean, the cores are all right. For the most part, this doesn't really seem to... Like, everything else has so many... That's my. I think that's why I'm confused, is... Everything else in this game has so many things you can do with them... That this, this particular one seems kind of bland. Like, by comparison. It's like, yeah, no, you just build towers. 
like, oh, sweet. I mean, yeah. Ah, oh, well, maybe I'll unlock some more here shortly. We shall see. Start construction. I have all the materials for that. So I'll be able to unlock a big... Well, okay, coming soon. So no, I won't be able to unlock the big keep. Disappointing, but okay. Alright, food and everything is finally, finally good. So... Uh, no, I'm not going to assign those woodcutters. Uh, those woodcutters are up here. I'm going to kill them off and move them down here shortly. But let's get our treasury filled. Okay. Now should probably start working on some other items. And my iron mines are over here, so I should probably put... Ooh. So I need an iron smelter and a blacksmith. Hmm. And I'm gonna need coal huts. The coal huts are not, should never be near, uh, what's it called, um, houses. So I feel like a good place for a pair of coal huts, uh, coal huts, coal huts is going to be over here in these woods. And then I think an iron smelter would be a good fit here on the edge of that. And a blacksmith would be a good fit, probably right here. See, because this is a constant supplier of wood up here. Also, I'm gonna put a warehouse right here. And that'll be for coal. Okay, I'm not expecting this to be done anytime soon because some of the materials we have to trade for. No, I don't care what the envoy wants. So yeah, we're only gonna get this up to 20, 19 or 20, so. I know this is taking up all my builders for a while because they're Shuffling along with all the materials. It's going to suck up so many of my materials. Maybe I should buy some glass. Trade. That's all I need is 10, right? And there is a neighboring city that sells it. Yep, for 50 gold a shot. Ouch. But I need it. Okay, so I can also lower the prices if I keep making those particular people happier. So I really should have been working on the Allegiance to lower these prices. I mean, I'll work on it, though. Never too late. Yeah, I'm still not sure about this. Uh, clearly, we don't need the farms anymore. I mean, we are easily keeping up with our bread supply and our clothing supply now. And the berries are skyrocketing. So yeah, I don't think we have to worry about the food so much. So I could probably start assigning a few more builders. Because we have some massive projects going right now. Yes, 
builders. I think I might actually take all but two of you guys and make, well, you know what, let's make all of you into builders for now. Because I'm also going to go into this pretty big house improvement spree. Like we're going to authorize housing upgrades. And I'm sure all these people want to upgrade their stuff. And here's some new villagers. These ones won't be assigned to building. There's no need for it. We just added, what, six people to the building core? <laughs> we have enough. They're probably all going to be focusing on this for a while. Glass has not been delivered yet. Planks are almost fully delivered. Polished stone's probably going to take a while. There's no way we had 1,800 polished stone just laying around. We most certainly did not. Uh, let's help the clergy this time. Ooh, we ain't got the fish. I mean, we'll help them and we'll see if we get the fish. Wait, it says I have 28 fish. What? What? Why do we not have enough fish? I have 31 fish. Why don't we have enough fish? You guys just deliver the gold already? I know I got the gold. Gold is not an issue. Deliver the required materials. Hmm, glass isn't even shown here. I wonder if it's just not even factored in any uh, yet. Looks like I'm going to have to increase my fishing huts. Which is actually fine. They're a non-intrusive option. Most of them are in the water. Not a building issue I'm worried about. Oh, look at that, our planks nosedived. Good. That just means we'll be able to clear out our wood stockpile. And then my lumberjacks can actually get back to work. Because a lot of times my lumberjacks kind of just stand around. Because the each one of these places, as you guys pointed out to me, I wasn't aware. Because I wasn't really paying attention to it. But they hold a hundred uh, of their own resource. So when it got to a hundred, they just kind of... Meh. Just stood around. Especially if the warehouses themselves got full. Alright, so we got a few new people. Let's see what jobs I can give them. Might be time to start throwing in some... Some more soldiers, I think. I mean, working at the Lord's Manor has got to be nice, right? But yeah, I'm thinking about lining the Lord's Manor with some fishing huts or just putting a few up here. Because there is still space for them. Three hundred people. Really? And most of them are serfs. That's got to have some angry people. You're lacking church. Well, you know what? I left this open. This isn't even done yet. I could easily expand the church capabilities. Ooh, look at that first tower. Biggest problem is going to be finishing this off, I think. Who makes polished stone? I should probably have another one of them around. Because I... Yeah. I know I didn't have many of them. Stone. I think I might only have one stonemason in the entire place. Let's try to keep them near the stone camps, though, shall we? So there's a stone, mace, a stone camp right there. I'll put in a second stonemason there. I think that's our only stonemason. The one. Oh no. 
I'll put one in here. Okay, I'll put one here. Wait, I think that's one I already got. Yep, I already got that one. I don't want to overlap them again. But stonemason can go here. And a stonemason can go... Yes, there's one over here. I'm not sure what lord would be okay with a stone mason being right next to the manor, because that, that's probably some loud work. But it still works. And none of that's going to be ready for a while. Which is fine. All right. So I think this is a fairly good place to stop. So thank you everybody so very much for watching. And if you enjoyed this video at all, then please by all means feel free to like, comment, subscribe, or any combination of those actions that suits you today. And while there isn't a lot more content to show in this game, new stuff, we should at the very least, I want to finish this, I want to finish the manners, and I want to see what we get when we unlock enough Kingdom Splendor, which is gonna be hard. Because as you can see, I need to get 40, and even with all this stuff I'm planning on building down here, I'm only going to get to like 20. So yeah, it's going to be interesting. But, we'll see how that goes, and like I said, we will, at the very least, see all of that stuff before ending the series to see... Before we end the series and wait for like the next content update, which they are pretty regular with them, so we should see another one fairly soon. Well, I can't really speak to that. I haven't done the research, but let's hope we see one fairly soon after we end this series. But yeah, we still have a lot of stuff to finish before we do. And also, as a quick uh, update, for those of you who are thinking about becoming a patron or are or already patrons, I've gone ahead and put up, as of today, two more videos in our patron-exclusive series over at... Uh, patreon.com slash Aratha so feel free to check those out if you like and if you do check them out I really hope you enjoy the videos thanks again for watching guys